Hey, what's up, guys? I am back. Uh, second session of the day using this platform. I've looked at this dealer. She started at depth of three, depth of one, currently on a depth of one. So there is a potential for the reverse area key. Now, you might notice my balance is back at 267. I did withdraw the 67, but uh, I've had a look here in my messages and uh, I tried doing it twice, but it says uh, we attempted to process your recent withdrawal request, but unfortunately it was declined. <laughs> a withdrawal being declined. Uh, funds have been credited back to your balance. We recommend that you speak to your payment method provider to see why your account was unable to accept payments. So I'm going to have to sort that out, but I thought I'd just do another session. Uh, where did that one go to? That's gone to number uh, nine. So yeah, back on a depth of two. So, yeah, she's had depth of three, depth of one, currently on a depth of two. Just going to watch her for a few spins. If she continues with this, uh, I've been tracking this dealer since she arrived at the table on number 13 was when uh, she got to the table. And uh, so far, yeah, there's potential. It could be reverse area key. Let's have a look and see what we can do. She's hit the unhighlighted section six times and the highlighted section twice. And uh, obviously it's kicking me off because I haven't placed a bet. <laughs> but we'll just refresh that. So yeah, I do quite a few uh, sessions where we're doing the highlighted sections. Uh, has that one landed? I think, uh, yeah, that went to number seven. Okay, so that's going to transfer that depth of two out. So you can see here, depth of three, depth of one, depth of two. Just watch it for a few spins. We've only tracked her for 10 spins, but we'll see if she continues to favor the unhighlighted area of the wheel. She's having a little dance now. Okay, she's back in the highlighted, so maybe there's nothing in this one. I uh, thought it was interesting, but uh, maybe I was wrong. So that's gone to number 12. So now we've got a highlighted back to highlighted. So I'm going to scrap this table. Uh, but I do know that I can record one, two, three, four, five, let's say six results because uh, it's now 10 past two in the afternoon. And. Um, I don't even know what table that was. Was that Nottingham? I don't know. Um, let's try Vic London. Yeah, uh, it looked like they switched out the dealer dead on the hour. So let's have a look here. This is a different one. So you, it's reversed here. So let's uh, refresh this bad boy. We're going to go in from number 17. Oh, in fact, no, let's uh, undo that. Uh, we'll go from zero. Um, no, 30. 30 sounds good. So we're going to go 30, then 0, 21, 7, 32, number 4, and 34. So depth of 1, 1, 0, currently on a depth of 0. So let's have a look. I'll put a bit of volume on. That's gone to 23. So that's another highlighted. So one one zero zero zero. This table is actually nice because you can do a neighbor bet of nine, whereas the other table you can only do a neighbor bet of eight. So um, let's see what we can do with this one. One one zero zero zero. So the goal again. I'm gonna. That was the last session that we did. Uh, I'm gonna try and take fifty pounds profit and then I'm going to focus on seeing if I can withdraw the money on this particular platform because uh, it's no good building a balance if you can't withdraw it. <laughs> to 27 so that is back in the highlighted section again 27 red so a nice string of Please highlighted here heads. so 
I was chucking cash on the table. Not many people on the table though, only 2-1, but it is a real casino, you expect them to be less, but um, we'll see. See if this dealer continues favouring that highlighted section. So she released that from probably around number 10, 23 or 10. So like five or six numbers after the number she picked it up from. Okay, I had a bit of a ping back, but that's put it, kept it in the highlighted section on number 11. 11. So I'm starting to think this dealer might be okay on the highlighted section. So I'm going to go in with it, give it a try on number 11. We're doing one pound per number. We've only got 10 spins recorded, but so far she had depth of one, depth of one, then zero, 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 zero. So that's looking nice. I've seen it where you get a massive string, sort of like 15, 20, highlights in a row and uh, it's always frustrating when you uh, miss that opportunity and <laughs> you, you're like oh this dealer's smashing the highlighted section and then you start betting too late we'll see what happens this doesn't show you the dealer's name as well on any of the tables so it it's a bit of a drawback because it is nice to know what dealers are doing what Gonna carry on with the highlighted, hopefully. Number one. Yeah, we got it just on the end there. One red. But we'll take that. So I'm gonna put a win here. I'm gonna step across and I'm going to submit number one and then do again one unit per number on number one. So you can see here, very, very nice. One, one, then we've got one, two, three, four, five, six times in a row on the highlighted section. But obviously the real casinos, it does take longer for them to do the spins, but that's okay if they're consistent. Bets closing. No more bets, please. Keep going. Number 11, we got it right on the end again. 11 black. Okay, you win. so that is win Please number two. And uh, I'm gonna submit number 11, and we're gonna go straight back in on that one. So yeah, it's looking very, very nice. So you think about it, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight highlighted in a row with this dealer. Let's make it nine. <laughs> so I hope everyone's had a great weekend. Let me know in the comments what you got up to. I've done a bit of fishing. Is there anyone that likes fishing out there? I've been at catching gilt head bream. And uh, yeah, really, really good fighting fish go crazy in fact i'm going to set up a new youtube channel uh, called amazing. fish and tricks where I, me and my friend justin we're going to be doing some uh, fishing trips and i'm going to be doing a magic trick at the end of each episode so if you're into fishing or if you're into magic 
make sure you check that out. It's going to be called Fish and Tricks. Let's see if we can close out with a flawless victory. Uh, where's that gone to? Number 10. Yeah, absolutely perfect. This dealer is crushing it. Okay, so let's put that there. That's another win. That's given me £51 profit. Taking my balance up to 318. You'll see my um, name on this platform is RC for roulette calculators. So yeah, very, very nice signature. Look at that. Depth of 11000000000. Beautiful signature. Now, if you think if you're doing the Paroli, that's a um, positive progression where when you win, you double the bet. When you win, you double the bet and you keep doubling. That'd be insane. So if you think, uh, if you're doing say one pound, then it'd be two, four, eight, 16, 32, 64, 128 per number. <laughs> the profit would be insane. So yeah, there, there is the place for the reverse Martingale. And these are the sort of dealers that you want to find. But of course, if at any point this dealer did go to a depth of one, that obviously resets. But you kind of only lose your initial bet on doing that. I used to love doing the reverse Martingale. But for me, the step system all the way, this is a... I didn't really have to use it. It was just win-win-win, which is nice. But the reverse Martingale is a very, very nice uh, thing when you find a dealer. Just going to watch this uh, next spin, see if... Uh, they go back to the highlighted section again. I'm not going to sit and watch it all day because I've got things to do. I'm going to go out for a fish a bit later on. Um, I made £118 profit today, which is nice. I just need to make sure I can withdraw that. So I want to see this in the tier section, see if uh, it carries on. Flawless, number six. So highlighted again. So we'll input that. Please place your beds. And then check it out. All of those zeros. Hopefully, you'll be able to see the dealer in one of the pictures. Uh, it is a lady by the look of it. But yeah, for some reason, uh, this platform doesn't show you the dealer's names. Um, probably for security reasons, because it is at a real casino. And they might not want people knowing who they are in case someone had a bad run and targets them but anyway i hope this episode was informative i hope you got something out of it i am enjoying playing on these real tables i'm not seeing any manipulation uh, i'll keep looking out for it but they seem pretty pretty fair just the way the balls are landing uh that's gone to 31 okay so that's the first time it has gone to the unhighlighted section so let's submit that i will watch one more spin see if this dealer does go back to the highlighted but yeah starting off depth of one what this could have been a previous dealer i don't know but um yeah huge amount of zeros in a row now currently on a depth of one so we're going to do one more spin just to see if they go back to that highlighted section or if i was just uh you know good and i got out at the right time <laughs> it is always interesting to see I'd, I'd expect it to go to the highlighted section now just because of the dealer's history but as we all know a dealer can change what they're doing and this dealer might end up just hitting the unhighlighted section over and over and over i think the key is strike while the iron is hot and if the pattern changes you have to change with the pattern but yep straight back in the highlighted on number 22 so you'll see that that depth of one now gets transferred very very nice dealer this is the sort of dealer you're looking for so you do find them you have to be patient make sure you don't just go on and start betting on the highlighted area because it's green go oh yeah that must be good you have to look at the depth of wins you have to analyze the dealers and you need to find the dealers like this don't just bet for the sake of it be patient and if you follow the guidelines you know find the consistent dealers uh you will get unlucky sometimes you will see a big block of zeros and then start betting and suddenly the dealers changed it that's what the stop loss is in place for and that is why if you get two consecutive losses you need to stop betting and evaluate the dealer and uh, don't play with emotion anyway hopefully these tips help i'll speak to you on the next one
Take care and bet smart. Subscribe now.